Greetings, Earthlings. I am Kang. Do not be frightened. We mean you no harm. You, you speak English. I am actually speaking Rigelian. By an astonishing coincidence, both of our languages are exactly the same. Well, what are you going to do with this, man? Kodos and I are taking you to Rigel 4, a world of infinite delights to tantalize your senses and challenge your intellectual limitations. Look, I know that to you we Simpsons are a lower order of life. We face that prejudice every day of our lives. But we are happy on our little planet. We throw ourselves on your mercy. Please return us to... Dinner time. Hey, get a load of that spread. Here you go, Earthlings. Take all you want, but eat all you take. Well, thank you very much, mister. To pronounce it correctly, I would have to pull out your tongue. Ooh. Fried shrimp. Sloppy Joes. Mother pork chops. Look, Homer. Radish Ooh. rosettes. These are hard to make. They're a very advanced race. Come, Earthlings, eat. Grow large with food. There's something not quite right about this. Girl's right. Let's get some applesauce out here for these pork chops. What are you looking at, buddy? Your wife is quite a dish. Ooh, thanks. Dinner time. Hey, how come we never see you guys eat? Oh, uh... We wouldn't want to spoil our appetite for the great feast when we land on Rigel 4. Ooh, a feast! Will we be invited? Oh, you'll be at the feast. I have a feeling you'll be the guests of honor. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us more about this feast. No, no, eat now. When we arrive, there will be plenty of time to chew the fat. <laughs> Very good, Earth Boy. <laughs> Excellent, Mr. Simpson. Excellent. <laughs> this will give these humans the Perfect flavor. You have stopped eating. Listen, you big, stupid space creature. Nobody, but nobody eats the Simpsons. I beg your pardon. Don't play dumb with me. We found your book. Uh, you mean this? <laughs> it's a harmless cookbook. It's just a little dusty. <sighs> Wait a minute. There's still more space dust on here. <sighs> Let me get this straight. You thought they thought we were going to eat them. <laughs> Good God. Is this some kind of joke? No, they're serious. Well, why were you trying to make us eat all the time? Make you eat? We merely provided a sumptuous banquet. And frankly, you people made pigs of yourselves. I slaved in the kitchen for days for you people. And <laughs> well... If you wanted to make Serac the Preparer cry, mission accomplished. You aren't the only beings who, who have emotions, you know. 